if you desire what's most important more so than what's not important, then you can truly transcend your personhood very quickly in a very integrated and balanced way. Without bypassing anything, you simply deeply investigate what is the core issue here. And the core issue, the core imbalance is that I fear discomfort. When has discomfort ever killed me? When has it ever made awareness dis uncomfortable? When has discomfort ever disturbed that which knows? Awareness goes unaffected. I still exist. Oh, I'm so nervous. So much discomfort. My thoughts are blaming the discomfort. Why am I still uncomfortable after all these years of spiritual integration? Beingness does not care. Existence is still here. Oh, but what about this? Awareness is observing. When have you ever been uncomfortable? other than thinking that you were. Physical sensations do no harm to existence. Did you know that? None of the universe cares when you're having an emotion. <laughs> Not really. I mean, it cares in a relative way because you're on a journey and it's guiding you and it's, it's attracting you to come closer to the one infinite realization while also expressing who you are. But creation does not budge when you feel a certain way, believe it or not. This is not about you. When you get over the idea that this is all about you, in a personal way, that this is all about me and what I feel is so important, but when you realize that there's infinite parallel realities and there's infinite experiences, quote unquote, out there, really inside of awareness, different frequencies, different shots of awareness, angles, points of view of awareness, there's nothing out there, which we'll get into more too in the later sessions. But you can realize that you do not have to be afraid of any sensation because you are indestructible existence. When you investigate this clearly enough, it will liberate you. And then you can start seeking in a balanced way without falling into conclusions and mind traps. Whenever you need to hold on to a conclusion about uh, enlightenment, awareness, or the journey, or the path, or the way to it, when you've come to a conclusion that this is the best way, or this is the truth, that's a clear indication that you are still afraid of discomfort. Because a being in true balance does not fear discomfort. Does not fear discomfort. Does not fear discomfort. And a being in true balance therefore never comes to conclusions because it doesn't have to to feel safe. It's ever open, ever now, ever fresh, ever unbiased, ever impersonal, yet so intimate, so close to everyone and everything closer than the beating of your own heart, I am with you right now. Awareness is intimate with all experiences, yet unaffected by any of them. Become like this by simply realizing that this is already how you are. This is already how your life operates. You're already free. You're already aware. You've already never been hurt, harmed, destroyed, filtered, destructed destroy it. You are indestructible. You are eternal. You are awake. You are aware. You are flawless. Like an absolute, pristine, clear, indestructible mirror. Flawless awareness is here now. Take two to five seconds, twelve times a day, to recognize the natural state of awareness being already here. And you will find enlightenment is yours.